fierce and dangerous in nature. He is mean and brutal in action. He is fierce, rugged and ruthless. Fierce nobody, respect of nobody. Well, it's a typical day. Um, just um, heading to the site to see what these uh, boys are doing for me. You know the ultra modern um, complex that I am erecting for the people of my community. Yes. You have to go see what these boys are doing. <laughs> I'm going to see you again. I'm going I called to felicitate with you. Uh, I heard that your first daughter got married. I'm sorry that I couldn't make it, but uh, you know that I'll be confident. Here's the book, man. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Is that so? Uh, driver, driver, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. Is that so? Ah. Uh, Ambassador um, the next time we convene, I, I will bring it up. Yes, I'll bring it up and then we can look at it. Your Majesty, you can see everything is ready. And for a start, we need like 30 trees of sand, 5 tons of stones, then coming to road, we need like 100 length, 16 mm. Then 12, I mean, we need like 16 to 100 lines. Then, I guess erosion is going to disturb us here. But with enough flat track, we can fill in this place so that everything will be in order. That's all for now. I have come for us to end this madness here once and for all. I got the information that you're here. Thank God, Akubese, I met you here. I have fuel. Akubese, I have fuel. I have matches and I have lighter. If you know that you're a man, Akubese, come. Akubese, come and let us end this madness here. I will burn you and burn myself for refusing to give me my bride. For refusing to give me my queen, the woman I spent so much on. My investment. Come, Akubese. Akubeza, come! Dear me! Hold this guy down. Hold him down. Tylon, search the car, please. Hold him down. Hold him down. Hold him down. Set that car, please. Swam at your uncle. Be fast about it, walk him. Hey, man. My friend, go! Be fast about it! Get. 
Don't touch my car! Don't touch my car! Don't touch my car! Let me go! I'm going to go! Let me go! Let me go! Go! Hate is fierce and dangerous in nature Hate is mean and brutal in action Let me go! Hate is fierce Rugged and rootless Fears nobody Respect of nobody Why did you kill him? Does he deserve to live? He was one of our fourth man. He was loyal. He was one of the... He doesn't deserve to die, Akubese. Come on. I think that we're mourning two lovers here. What do you mean? <laughs> I lost a good girl too. So why don't you go mourn your lover? Why do you leave me alone? To mourn mine in peace. Akubeze, can you just stop killing people as if they are animals? Can you stop? Will you shut up? Neka, you should be thankful that that young man chose to carry your cross for you. If not that you are a big part of my organization and handling my business, I would have made you suffer the same fate for lying to me. You lied to me. I'm looking at you. And I'm thinking trying to decipher why that young man chose to thread that path. Was it because of love? Hmm? Neka. Get out of my room. Get out of my room this minute and allow me mourn my loss too. For I forget that you are a big part of my organization and ask for your head and neck. <laughs> so he gave it to you, no problem. Yes, well, that's good. Um, <clears throat> I've been thinking of something lately. Um, don't you think it would be wise if you can set up something like a business so that you can take care of these kids? As a matter of fact, these children need to go back to school. So I think it would be a very nice idea if you can start up something. Um, <clears throat> Overlandlord, 
to tell you the truth, I have been thinking about this for a long time now. Okay. But I just don't want to complain to you anymore. You have done so much for me and my kids. I am indebted to you. Uh, no, no, no. See, look, it's nothing. Listen to me. These children need to go back to school. They need to go back to school. So you have to set up something and, I mean, so that you can take care of them. It's okay. Um, I think... Uh, I'll give you some money to start up something. Eh? Yes. Ogala Lord. <laughs> hey, Ogala Lord, thank you no, so no, no, much. No, no, no. Thank you. Don't do this. No, let You're me. embarrassing me. I don't like Ogala it. Lord, you have done so much for me. How else do I say thank you? No, no, no. Sit down, sit down. Stop doing this. Stop doing this. I am doing this as a, out of the magnanimity of my heart. Hi. I'm led to do it, so allow me. It's okay. Thank you so much, sir. It's okay, my dear. Ezimwa, I... I don't know where you'll be free to tell me more about your husband. What actually transpired between you and your husband? Is it that he just walked out on the marriage or something or is it that he brought in another woman and you decided to live with the kids what actually transpired um okay landlord a time will come when i shall tell you everything yes i know you're like a father to me but please not now well if you say so um Okay, let's talk about the business now. What kind of business would you like to venture into? I have a lot, a lot of business I want to do, but I'll start with one first. I think uh, by tomorrow I will expect you to. Uh, okay, I'll come. I'll come and give you the money. Okay, uh, but first, you have to tell me the kind of business you would like to venture into. I have my business idea already. Uh, are you sure? <laughs> yes, sir. I do go. Mama. When is this your boyfriend coming to see me? Not all the time you be telling me about him while I have not set my eyes on him. Mama, stop budging yourself. He will come and see you. I've told him already. He even said he will come this evening to see you. Are you sure? I'm sure. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Ngwa, let me ask you. I hope you have not uh, opened Ihiji Blonwai. I mean your honey pot. He has not tested it. Mama, he has tested it too. Hey! Mama, I will not lie to you. You are not another person. He has tested it. Ah. Uzubu, uzubu. Ah, ah. How do you go? Why will you do that? Don't you know that uh, if you had held your honey pot tight, to make him to want to come and do everything so that he will start testing it. Eh? Now that you have given it to him, the assurance of him coming here is very slim. Mama, see, this is our time. This is not this is 2023. Whether I give it to him or I don't give it to him, he loves me. This is my man, Mama. Do you want him to start thinking I'm ungrateful? Do you want him to start seeing other girls? There are so many other girls in this village, Mama. I'm not the only fine girl. Fine girls choke. So if I don't give it to him, he will go and get it elsewhere. And I don't want to lose this man. So mama, calm down. He's my man. He loves me and I love him. So no shaking. He will come and see you. Don't worry. He's your... He will come and see man, you. if you say so, so uh -uh, Who is... Uh, who is doing that now? He's your sister. Hey, wait. Your sister and her. Uh -huh. Okada boyfriend. <laughs> uh -uh. Mama, she's pushing the bike. Uh -uh. She's pushing... Hey! Yeah. Ulima, so far, no, this girl. Hey! So far, no, Look at her. She can even repair fine. <laughs> hey! Ulima. Hey. Hey. Ulima. My mama won't go on about one. I'm not fear. Who is your mother? Do I look like your mother? Stupid girl. 
You didn't tell me you have learned how to repair a motorcycle. Mama, he brought me back then. His bike got spoiled. So I tried helping him to push it. Child. <laughs> <laughs> so, is it manage fit <laughs> I'm telling you, what? <laughs> when his bike gets spoiled, his mechanic wife will repair it. That's husband bike man and wife bike mechanic. Ah! <laughs> 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 was pushing it from the back. Come on! Hey. I hope you you bought everything I asked you to buy in the market. Yes, Mama. How many times will I tell you to stop calling me mama now? Are you mad? Do I look like your mother? Can I have a daughter like you? Can't you see my daughter? She can't be like me. She can't is the difference not clear? Like can't you see the difference? I'm not to know if you're an Only a baby if you're not an Come on, get into the kitchen and do what you know how to do best. I'm not mama. So far, so far, everywhere. Yes, mama, yes, mama. Mama, 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 go on my bound. So far, no, they tire you. See the way, see the way she was. Imagine pushing by. Hi! Hi, yeah. Just look at the way you are now. So classy, so clean. The man that came to, he said he wants to do what? Do what again? Eh? I have given you a terms and conditions. But if you cannot work with it, I am going to ask my boys to uproot your mast, cut it into pieces, and throw it out of my kingdom. For so long, your people have taken advantage of my people. But it's a new dawn. All that happened in the past. Huh? stays in the past. Things are different. Your Majesty, 100 million right to be paid per year is such an atrocious amount. We have other states and communities where our masks are situated and they do not take such an atrocious amount of money. What other state or what community are you talking about? Young man, you do not attribute my royalty to that of a cheap old hag sitting on a stool begging for arms. I am the leopard of this universe. I am the king of kings at the mention of my name. All the kings. Wow. On behalf of my partner here, your majesty, I sincerely apologize. He showed me no disrespect to you. Please forgive him. Tell your boy to braid up his tongue. Tell him to learn to watch his language when he addresses a supreme monarch. Highly noted, your imperial majesty. I believe that this meeting is over. I do not negotiate. Akubweze does not negotiate. But even the gods. <laughs> Talk less of my mortals. <laughs> I'll call that for eh? A hundred million naira. It is. I must be paid into my account within the next 48 hours. And the leopard has spoken. Uh, your Imperial Majesty. Uh, uh, oh, forgive my spirit. Oh, hell, the king. Lordship, it's okay. How long are you going to continue to cry like this? I mean, it's two days already. How long will you continue to cry? Jessica. Why I did not say a word to me before he died. I, I, I don't even know what happened to him. I don't know why he ate. I can't even it's see. Okay. <laughs> no matter how much you cry, Obona is not coming back. He's dead and gone. 
life still continues. Life goes on. See, what you just need to do right now is take care of yourself and his baby. Okay? And I think you need to leave this palace. Yes, it's not safe for you. Jessica, what are you saying? What you're saying is impossible. I can't leave this palace. You know that. Lochi, I have a suggestion. What is your suggestion? Come with me. Come with me. Wait a minute. Didn't you hear what His Majesty said? No, no, no. Am I deaf or I heard a different thing? That the whole millions will be paid into his account, his personal account. He did not even consider the regular 9 million naira to be paid into the community account. That's a whooping sum. I think those people will not be able to match up. So let them remove their mast and get out of our land. This is pure wickedness. If we cannot all benefit from it anymore, then let them get out of our kingdom. The mast will not be pulled out. Mm. Yes. They have no choice. You think so? Yes! What baffles me is that the no member of late Mazi Ebuka's house was available during the meeting. You are correct too. You are getting the right point. His Majesty is just trying to play one of his shady games. I think uh, it is now obvious that in all the cabinet members, those in their own palaces, our own, the only thing that is significant in our own is that we just go to our own palace and right. sit, watching. It's so obvious that we are bench warmers. So it seems very unfortunate. Yeah. Oh no. Amadi. Hmm? Udoga. Can't we just dethrone him? What? what? Eh? Okay. Has frustration made you forget the tradition? If even embracing the old way is not an easy road to go, which of you will be able to touch or even open the ancient books of record after what he did to us and, and, and the, all the threats he has been making towards us? Man. Which of you will dare touch Oh no! Okay. I agree you. I greet you seriously. Oh no! Thank the gods that you are here. Oh no. They say that men, real men, are not supposed to be chasing after rats while their houses are on fire. Oh no. Why is it that men of the cabinet has decided to be chasing rats? Why the kingdom is on fire? Oh no. What is the matter? Listen to me, you know. This is from following these men. These evil men who do nothing but go about the kingdom sleeping with people's wives. Evil widows. Look at them. Look at their faces. They are just shut up there. Are you mad? Hmm? Do they have respect for elders? Well, let, 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 let me ask you. Are you an elder? No, are you part of the elders? If they say elders should come out, will you also come out? Look at him. Nekod. I don't blame you people. Oh no, will listen. The little respect I have for you, please do not in any way allow me pocket it in my pocket. 
Don't allow me to put it back into my pocket. Please, I beg you, no. Richard, this is enough. This is from following these people. They are evil. This is enough. That's a drunk talking. You are drunk. May the, may the thunder that they have wrong. no children, a ruthless thunder fire you. Drunk. Let us go. I don't blame you. I don't blame you people. Okay. You took what does not belong to that man and you gave it to him. Gosh. Drunk, talking to us. Can you imagine? <laughs> Buna. Buna, why did you do this to me? Why did you do this to me? I trusted you, I, I believed you. Why, 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 why? Why? Oh God. This is too hard for me to believe. This is too hard for me to think. I don't wonder. You know chairs won't bring him back, right? <laughs> I'm sorry for your loss. He was a humble servant and a lawyer one. Though I didn't have much time to spend with him. I'm sorry for your loss. Stop crying. <laughs> crying is not going to bring him back. Move on. In case you need anything, do what to let me know. Take care of yourself. Thank you. You're welcome. Yes, my queen. You said you are pregnant for him. Yes, my queen. And how long have you been dating in this palace? Three years now. Wow. Oh. See. It's got a long dating. My husband, the king, killed your boyfriend. Yes. You're 70, right? Y yes, my queen. You know, you can actually take your revenge. That's the only way we will not so rest in peace. I mean, he cries for vengeance. So, Lodgy, take it. Take the risk. And I wish you good luck.
Please, I, I don't want you to leave. Please. I brought you to this palace so you can be close to me. Please. I said, well, whatever I've done, I'm sorry. Please. It's okay. I mean, everything is fine now. It is your wish to be queen. And you're queen now. Look at you. Oh, please. You have to let me go. Do you know, my brother wants me to come over to Europe. Europe? Yes. Oh, when I can do better, you will gain more here than, than when you go to Europe. So please, I do not want you to go. Please, I, I will treat you better here. Anything you want, whatsoever, I will do it. Please stay. Sweetheart, do you know this, this will not last. <sighs> this whole thing will not last. This king is dangerous. Someday, somehow, will be caught and probably put to death. I don't want something like that for us. Mona, Please. I do not want us to miss you. When I say us, you, you understand what I mean, right? I do. I have already planned out something. Once I put to bed, I will make sure Ogonna leaves this palace. And then we'll handle Akubeze. We'll take him out. And uh, you and I will rule this kingdom forever. Hey, that's not correct. Look, it's not, it's not nice to kill a king and marry his personal guard. I will look suspicious. Check it out now. Please. All I'm saying is, let me go. Let me go and start a family. And be useful to myself. I beg you. I know. Oh, well, now. You will leave when I want you to leave. But... Eh? No, but... You seem to mourn this young man in a very special way. Hmm. He's indeed a memory in your heart. You know I hate it when you're very comfortable. <laughs> I should be minding my business. But it's fine. We just lost a cartel and a friend. Right? Princess Uguna. Hi! I am a queen. I am your nightmare. My presence in this palace after so many years should infuse a discomfort in your spine. Tell that black cat, as he calls himself, that I am back and I'm back for real. Wait, who are you again? Who is she? Oh, I see. He's gotten a new wife. <laughs> Good. It's pleasing to you, Neka. My regards to that new part. Hey. 
And you learn to tame your mouth. Ouch. <laughs> Sorry. Nobody. 